welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is terry thank you for stopping by please subscribe and join the gang if you're not new here thank you for always watching my videos and for watching yet another video i look so crazy starting this vlog but trust me i'm gonna look cute before the end of this vlog so stay tuned um thank you guys so much for the love on my moving out vlog and my on my instagram like you guys i feel like you guys understand this journey because you've been with me literally from the word go from zero from nothing and you've seen me i've been so transparent in sharing my highs and my lows i share with you guys when i'm going through something and i share with you guys when god has showed up for me so it felt like you guys understand how big this win is for me and it felt like you guys are also owning up like nika you're, you're participating in taking the like i don't know how to say it it's like you guys get it you know <laughs> let me just say like that you get it and i just love that for us i love that i'm able to show my life and i'm bro like it's so empty but anyway i just love that i'm able to show you guys how working with god is not linear it's not um just up 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 there are going to be lows there are going to be downs but trust when god takes you from that down to an up when god takes you from your low moment to a higher moment he doesn't play god does not play god does not play and i am saying this here and i i will say this over and over again i will go through anything and anything on this world as long as god is walking there with me and as long as i know my latter days will be better than my former days i have that i saw that verse I saw that verse. I don't know. I, I I keep forgetting. I'll put it on the screen here. But that verse got me like it really encouraged me and it got me feeling like no matter what blessing you go through, that is not the end of it. You have not seen anything because sometimes you go through a big moment in your life and then you're like, ah, maybe it, ne it will never get better than this. Maybe this is it. Maybe this is the best God could do. No your latter days meaning the days to come will be better than your former days meaning whatever you've seen god do in your life that's nothing that's nothing compared to what's coming okay that's the god i serve i am traveling i am traveling i am going to i don't know if i'd have said so you can understand my video my name in my next video Okay, let me not say in this video, but I'm going to another state. I'm going to another state. Um, we have a family friend who is hosting me for the summer break. Like one thing about me, Carbondale is a college town. So once the school close, closes, the, like this place becomes dead, like literally dead. And I'm not about to stay here in a dead town for three months. So I'm going to visit our family friend in another state. I'm going to stay there for the summer break. I am really going to miss my house, but at least I'll know once I'm back from coming up. Once I come back here, I know I'll be coming back to my beautiful house and I'll be ready to renovate it and just, you know, enjoy every moment. So I'm traveling and um, my supervisor is coming to pick me up. I think in an hour or so. Because he was going to work and then come to pick me up later. I'm going to stay with him. Today's on th today's on Friday. So I'm going to stay to Friday night, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. And I'm traveling on Tuesday. Yeah. So enjoy this house. <laughs> and the next time you're going to see me in this house will be in August. So yeah. I'm just going to show you what I've done. Um, my supervisor came yesterday and he helped me fix up my bed. Because you know, Uku, the bed comes in pieces. I bought it off Amazon. So it came in pieces and I had to, like we had to fix the pieces by ourselves. I could not have done it on my own. So thank God he came. He helped me do that. So my bed is set up. Um, I've put up some things in the kitchen, but it's still pretty empty. But I just want to show you guys so that you get a glimpse and get the last the last scene <laughs> of this house until august and i don't even know if i'm going to vlog by the way i don't think i'm going to vlog in that state because i'm so mentally tired and i need the break 
so i don't know how it goes i might vlog but i know i i don't think i'll edit and post as much so on the kitchen counter i put the air fryer over there this are some of my water bottles um the microwave these are some of the sodas that i still have because i have these two these two i haven't opened any of them at least this one i've been drinking kidogo and then there's this one okay guy i need to give these things out because now it's in a jazana i even put some in the fridge and i'm not even going to be drinking them my fridge is still empty but yeah so that's how it looks i put my painting over here because i really love my painting and this is how i put some hand wash soaps over there my cabinets are literally empty because i have nothing like <laughs> this is a joke <laughs> these are some of the foodstuffs i had in my room they're not yet spoiled so i carry them here but literally this is it imagine this is like the way i'll need to do grocery shopping when i come back is insane i've been accumulating these coins anytime i'm given these things as change i just keep them because i don't i still up to now i still don't know when and how to use these coins now they're just accumulating here imagine but anyway more empty spaces Okay, I'm so excited. I can't wait to come back and do cooking videos. Um, here's the bed, guys. This is how it looks in my bedroom. I feel like it matches the walls. And I bought this um, silk bed sheet from TikTok shop. It fits perfectly. And I can't wait to go and buy even more colors because I had the green one and I felt like I have outgrown the green one. So now I bought a pink one and i love this shade of pink this is my favorite shade of pink and my bed lights up by the way <laughs> yeah my bed lights up can you see i've switched off the light so that you can see it better this is how it looks um this is how it's gonna look at night though it's not yet dark visually so you can't get the best picture but you kind of get it this is it in blue oh red um green and then there's yellow i feel like i like this blue more i've been leaning towards blue lately and also this cool tone so anyway that is it for now that is the update for now and i feel like the next time i'll see you it's either in my supervisor's house or when i'll be getting ready to go to the airport Oh my god, it feels good to know I'll be traveling again. I, I'm so excited to explore US, to explore America, because I feel like ever since I came here, it's been one year and I've only been to Carbondale. And everyone who's come to Carbondale says this is not the best representation of America because it's just so chilled and there's nothing much going on here. So they're like, you need to go to a fast city, you need to go somewhere where it's busy, you know, so that you can get the the real feeling of america so that's why i'm really really excited for this um for this trip but it's not a trip because i'm gonna be there for quite a while i will see you guys later um i just need to shower get ready and go to my supervisor's house hi guys I just woke up from a nap. That's why if I look different or weird, I just woke up from a nap. Anyway, today is on Sunday. Um, we went to church this Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the beautiful moms out there. All the moms just doing the best that they can and just giving their kids any kind of love that they didn't receive. You're, you're doing amazing. You're really doing amazing. And a special shout out to my own mother. This is the first Mother's Year that we haven't spent together. It feels different and it feels weird, but I know she's healthy. She's happy. She still has her other kids. It sucks because I should be your only child. Anyway, <laughs> I love you, mom. I really love you so much. I hope you enjoyed your Mother's Day. I hope you felt the love. I hope you know that we love you. I love you so much. I couldn't be who I am today, where I am today, 
without your endless love and support so happy mother's day to you mommy and happy mother's day to my grandma my aunties and all every other mom that my cousins who are moms my friends who are moms happy mother's day to any any mom who's watching this video happy mother's day to you and thank you for what you do thank you for bringing more life to this world and i pray god gives you strength and wisdom to take care of your kids and to also enjoy your own life like you're also this is your first time living life so don't forget yourself in the midst of raising someone else okay guys it's finally the day i'm going to the airport i wanted to do my makeup by way mm -mm. time in a fly i'm hot it's not even hot but i'm hot it's drizzling bro it's supposed to rain today <sighs> that's just cute anyway um my grandma <laughs> she made me some fried chicken <laughs> and she was like you can eat this before you get to the airport because the airport food is expensive so that's what i'm gonna have i already had breakfast but she said she'd rather have me eat before my flight it's a four hour flight so oh there he's coming i will see you guys when we get to the airport airport i'm taking terry up there to catch her flight to seattle for the summer oh that's your day huh yep I made it past the check-in I've checked in my bag I've checked in myself <laughs> now I'm going to find my gate my gate is C15 currently at C7 I see up to C9 C10 so I think I'll need to take a corner I can't believe I'm at the airport again it's been one year since I bought it a plane and I feel so excited <laughs> I'm so happy feels good may i be boarding flights every year in the name of jesus Amen. actually many times that year not just once 
I'm flying Alaska Airlines. I thought I will not say where I'm going, but I'm going to Seattle, Washington for summer. And I'm excited. C10. How do I go? Okay. I just got here at it's currently 12:20 but my flight I'm supposed to board at 1:55 so I have I think an hour to kill I'm just going to sit here and listen to some music nimekula nimeshiba I don't need to eat anything so yeah just waiting to board my plane my flight I'm so happy and I'm glowing so you wanna just see sweat I think my skin care get into skincare guys i forgot to wear my earrings and i feel like something is missing We just started boarding. Um, currently, the people that are going in are the first class people. I'm in economy, so I mean, one day, one day we're gonna be flying first class. I come on board to see how you tell me. Manifesting flying first class before I get to 30. So, anytime God wills, I will be there. The rain has subsided, Cassie, so I feel like. It's pretty good enough to start going. I'm so excited today. I love planes, I love flights, I love catching flights. Guys, I just landed in Seattle and I am currently looking for baggage claim. Oh, I've seen the I've seen the sign. I'm going to baggage claim to take my suitcase and then meet the family friend that's picking me up. I hope she's here. I have to meet her after this. 
I feel like I've lost sense in my ears. Like, I feel like I can't hear well because of when the plane was landing, something happened in my ears. So, Jenny, this is explain, Adi. But I'm so happy I'm here. I just arrived guys um i want to close the vlog here i will see you guys i'll see you guys when i see you guys i don't know when i'll vlog next or when i'll post next but let the summer begin okay <laughs> let the summer begin i'm just waiting nangoja is the magari i don't know which one she is i don't know her car so I'm just looking, hoping she sees me. Oh, Tesla! Teslas are so cute. Anyway, bye guys. Thank you for watching up to this point. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye!